I'm literally convinced that I am the last person in every single corner of the globe to be breaking her fast. It's literally about four or five hours since after iftar, and I've just, I, I still haven't broken my fast. It's just been one of those really, really crazy days. I've been on my feet from morning till night. So I'm just about to break my fast. I think everyone is probably about getting ready to go to bed. But in keeping with the healthy meal choices for both iftar and sahur during this holy month of Ramadan, I decided to go back to salad. Now, two good things happened today. Yesterday I spoke about a disaster that happened because I have a juice that I had bought to make green juice. And I've been so used to making green juice for my, myself, making green juice myself in the last couple of weeks. You know, I was determined to only be the one to make my own green juice. I had already mentally conditioned my mind that the only green juice I would take would be made by me. But yesterday my juice of thought otherwise. It just completely broke down. So I substituted the green juice yesterday with some very healthy iced tea, which is another form of drink that I really like. It's also very healthy the way I make it. Um, so today I wasn't able to get the juicer that I had wanted to. And I was just thinking to myself, okay, when I come back home, I'll go and, you know, find another way, another variety, another flavor to make the iced tea. But something really, really great happened. I came across an incredible fast food place here in Abuja. And I, of course, I've known of the place before, but I had the pleasure of, of meeting the proprietors of the fast food place. And I sat down and we had a long chat with her. And this particular place, I've, I've never known it before. I just came across it a couple of weeks ago. It's called The Wellness Spot or The Wellness Kitchen. There are two different um, spots. There are two different locations. There's one in, well, they're both in Wusei we'll 2 in the middle. For those who know um, Abuja in Nigeria, um, they're both in Wusei we'll 2. One is called The Wellness Kitchen and the other one is called The Wellness Spot. And they specialize in healthy food. They also specialize in making smoothies and making green juice. And, you know, those that have followed my journey through this Ramadan know that I've kind of committed myself to eating only healthy food and also committed myself to taking green juice and smoothies as well. So I sat down with the lady who owns these two, um, these two eateries. And, you know, she gave me a sort of background as to what led her to really, you know, try to experiment with making Nigerian food or introducing Nigerians to healthy eating and also making Nigerian food in a very healthy manner. Because as most of us know, Nigerian food is incredibly tasty, but probably not the healthiest. Now, that is <laughs> the reality of it. And I was incredibly impressed. And because I was having a really, really busy day, and I generally like to cook my food myself, um, I knew that I wasn't going to be able to come back home in time to make what I had wanted to make. So I sat down with a lady, we had a long conversation, and I, um, I, I bought her salad, I bought some ju juice, I also bought some green, uh, I got some smoothie it's a green, what, green juice but it's a green smoothie that she makes uh from of course i love avocados it's got avocado in there and um i was very very impressed and um I, though i haven't eaten it i spoke to a lot of the people that were eating in one of the one of the locations and apparently her food is absolutely gorgeous and um i'm going to give it a try and if it is as good as everyone says it is then I think I found my El Dorado, I think, on the days that I'm really, really very busy and I'm unable to come home and, and, and make the healthy dishes that I want to. I will go to the wellness spot and the wellness kitchen and see if I can get the different varieties that I want. So what I got here is um, um, seafood salad. And, you know, she makes... The seafood, I mean, I looked through the, all the ingredients that they had in there. 
and I think she makes her seafood salad very similar to the way I make my seafood salad as well. I think the only thing that I don't see in her seafood salad that would have been in mine, two ingredients, would, would be avocado and rocket. I don't see rocket lettuce here, rocket leaves here, and I don't see avocado. Those are the only two exceptions. But apart from that, I think it's, this is right up my alley. And this is her, this is her dressing, her salad dressing that she makes. And she told, she, I make my salad dressing, I've mentioned it in other videos. I make my salad, salad dressing uh, with seafood, with different kinds of seafood. And, you know, it's a special recipe that I've come up with. And she was telling me that this is her special recipe as well. And even though I've not broken my fast, when I was putting the food out, I did kind of, kind of lick it. And it tastes really, really, really nice. So I'm going to have this with my salad for uh, breaking my fast. Now, in addition, I also got um, this uh, smoothie from the Wellness Spot. And even though it isn't green juice, green smoothie, green juice, same difference. This is a uh, green smoothie made from, I think she said broccoli, avocado, peppermint. I love peppermint. I love broccoli. I love avocado. And I think apple. So this is, um, I'm just sure that's one of my family members calling to find out whether I've yet broken my fast because I know I kept on going on about, oh, I've got to, got to get home to break my fast. So this is a green smoothie that I got from the wellness spot and it's broccoli, it's avocado, it's apple and, um, uh, yeah, broccoli, avocado, apple and peppermint. So I think I'm really going to enjoy that and this is going to be a, a nice difference. It's going to be a, a nice change. To have, even though it isn't green juice, but it, it's still subtly, it's still a good, it's still in line with my whole green journey. So I, I think and I hope and I pray and I'm actually, yeah, I believe I'm really, really going to enjoy this as well. Now this is, I made this. I made this last night. I made it from it's apple. I juiced apple and um, peaches. Yeah, peaches. I love peaches, I love apples, so I made apple juice in my juice, so I, of course, removed the roughage. It required a lot of apple and a lot of peach to, to make this, so I, I wanted to have this as well, because I'd already conditioned my mind that I was going to have this today. I didn't, know, I didn't know that I would be able to get green juice today, so I thought, okay, if I'm going to have my... Uh, iced tea, maybe I'd have it with uh, some um, some apple and pe pear juice, peach, apple and pear, apple and peach juice, so I've got that over here, so I'll use that to break my iftar together with my salad and with my smoothie, and of course, my sparkling water, <laughs> this journey would never be complete without sparkling water, and actually that reminds me, I'm actually running low on sparkling water, so I'm going to make sure that first thing in the morning that we get sparkling water and put it in the fridge and that will be ready for the rest of the days of Ramadan. And so I've got extra cold water as well because I'm breaking my fast so late and I know, you know, I'm, I'm probably going to be really, 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 really thirsty. I am actually quite thirsty. So for Iftar, I also got this from the wellness kitchen. From Yeah, from the wellness kitchen, I got this one. It's two different spots. I think with one, the wellness spot, she makes kind of fast food. She makes really healthy pizzas, really healthy, I think, hot dogs, uh, burgers, shawarmas. I made a similar sort of shawarma the other day. I had a shawarma, I think, earlier on in the Ramadan that was quite healthy. And actually, she told me that she makes a similar sort of shawarma, even though there's a slight variation, but we both make it in a healthy manner. So in the wellness spots, you're able to get like fast food, also the um, smoothies and the green juice. At the wellness kitchen, which is also in Wusi, too, in Abuja, you're able to get more traditional food like a bar, um, pounded yam, uh, jollof rice, but made in a very, very healthy way. So this I got from the health, health, uh, wellness spot. And this is a smoothie that they made from... Um, 
It's apples, prunes, blueberries, and blackberries. Now, I I love berries. I love blackberries. I love blue blueberries. I love strawberries. Anything berries. The only kind of berries I don't like are gooseberries. I cannot stand gooseberries. So that's there's no gooseberries in here. So I've got. Uh, I think they called it. They told me that they called this particular smoothie Sweet Sixteen. Now I know I ain't nowhere near <laughs> near sixteen. It's been a long time. It's been a long time since I was 16, but I it's got a lot of berries in here, and I'm sure I'm going to really enjoy this. And I also got this from the wellness um, one the, from the wellness kitchen. I got this. This is um, grilled chicken, and we call it it's local chicken. I think it's not angry chicken, so it seems a bit quite dry, but uh, you know it smells quite nice. I think it was seasoned. It looks well seasoned, so it's just three pieces of um, grilled grilled chicken so that's what i'm gonna have for uh sahur so i'll put this back into the fridge and this as well let this cool and then early hours of the morning when i wake up i'll have my um sweet 16 smoothie together with my um with my grilled chicken